Hi guys, this is the equipment required to set up Pico. So you need one uh, cardiac output module, which is labelled Pico there. You need two standard pressure modules. You need a Pico monitoring kit. You need a Pico pressure cable that has this end on it. And you need one standard pressure cable as well. And you also need two pressure bags, one primed already because you're going to do central venous monitoring. And you need another pressure bag ready to go for your PICO monitoring kit. So what we'll do is we'll grab our PICO monitoring kit. Inside the package we've got a thermistor, which looks like this. So this goes onto a central line. You will need a central line in order to do your PICO cardiac output studies. So you cannot do PICO without a central line. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the brown lumen, prime this with normal saline, and then just screw it on and put the cap back on. I'm going to prime the line using one of the normal saline bags in the pressure bag. So I've got one here ready to go. To show them. So I'm going to prime the thermistor with normal saline. Okay, so that's primed and I'm going to attach it to the brown lumen. The Pico monitoring kit is primed, so the Pico monitoring line will be inserted by the doctor and then you pass this end to the doctor and he attaches it using a sterile technique. So I'm just going to pretend line already inserted to the patient, which I reinforce again is something that the doctor does. And let's just imagine that it's connected. The line in the groin. It's CVP monitoring in order to do your cardiac output studies, which is what you're aiming for with PICO. So what I'm going to do is I've already got one pressure bag primed and a monitoring line primed already and I'm going to attach it to one of the lumens on the central venous catheter. Mm -hmm. Then we've got our pressure monitoring modules and our cardiac output study module. So I'm going to put all three. See how it's labelled cardiothoracic now? I'm going to click on it and I'm going to select the one that says PICO. So you'll see that there are two that say PICO. You can do sepsis PA slash PICO or advanced PA slash PICO. It doesn't really matter, generally speaking, which one you choose because the main purpose of selecting PICO is so you can have both blood pressure show up. So the blood pressure showing up from the arterial line, which will be labelled ABP, and the blood pressure showing up from the PICO line that the doctor inserted, which will be labelled ART. So zero these devices like you would an arterial line. Okay, so what we have here on the monitor is we've got one module labelled ART, which is our PICO monitoring line and our PICO femoral line. We've got one module which is labelled CVP, which is connected to one of the lines on the central venous catheter. And then we've got one module that says cardiac output studies, which is our orange module.